What's up, everyone? It's your girl Alexia. I'm back with another video. It's all about, you know, be watching my bees right now, so as you can see. Anyways, I have my. Do this is so we're, so we're chilling we're relaxing we actually went to the mall and everything got some stuff yo I had some stuff from my family anyway anyways <laughs> we were watching this video of uh, bees no um not, not the door we're about to watch that one but we're watching this video about uh, with bees um reacting to this guy kissing his damn sister I I I just can't never unsee it I can I, I can't. <laughs> I, I saw it at first. I was like, I need someone else's opinion because bees was every like was my reaction the whole entire <laughs> video. So I was like, what's going on? <laughs> so I was like, you know, Jessica, I want to show you a video. <laughs> Just, so now I'm gonna get her uh, opinion. <laughs> Disgusting! I want to bleach my eyes. <laughs> that, that that's all. And, no, it's the fact that there's like, it wasn't just a, like a like a pet. It was a full fucking makeout session, um, and both of them were leaning into it. And the girl has the right to pull back and look disgust, but still let her brother pull her in for no. But it's so funny. The girl had stopped, and then her brother was like pulling her in. I was like, and then there was make. I was like, why that would was I be the girl? Why would I be the girl that just boxes her older brother in the face and be like, fuck off and get out of her room? I was done. I was like, it's Jessica was like hiding her face like, almost our entire was, like video. Okay, so, for that video, I was trying to not see this because mm -hmm. I knew it was coming, and I was like, "This has to be fake." Nope. And I was literally taking off my glasses because I'm like, "I want this blurred. I don't want a clear, <laughs> crystal fucking picture of the shit." This girl makes me put on my freaking glasses. I'm like, "Put your glasses back on," because if I have to see it, you have to see it too. Like, I'm gonna suffer, you're gonna see suffer it too. Blurry? No, if I have to suffer and see it 2020 vision, you have to do the same <laughs> thing. It's called paybacks, a bitch. <laughs> what did I do? Payback is a B. What did I do apparently? Many things that I got to get payback for. Yeah, apparently I did many things. To see a 2017? Fucking... Okay, never mind. That's a <laughs> Payback's a But miage. still, if you have a brother or sister, don't fucking kiss them. It doesn't matter if they're half. I don't care. They're still adopted. your sister. They're still your sister. Even if that bitch is a, even if one of those bitches are adopted, do not kiss. <laughs> I was dying. Like, the man tried to justify everything. Like, no, the she's one my, part she's I my sister. Get. I have two half sisters, you know, from, and I have one full. Doesn't matter. Okay, she's still your sister. He didn't justify on what sister he was kissing. Yeah, but it doesn't matter. He don't, no, no, that's the but here's my thing. We don't know if that's a half sister or the fucking full, freaking. Full blood but sister. Even if, even if there's a full sister and and you know okay, yes. he's the half sister, is... it's exactly it's just okay. like incest. Doesn't matter if the half sister's from I your dad's that, side. Doesn't it's matter from the mom's unless side. Unless it's a fucking peck on the cheek, that's it. E. That's kind of close because some people would just, I would smack my brother away. I'm like, no, fuck off. Unless you're eight years old. And we can't even. I mean, I'm not gonna say that's that's some white people stuff that would, that people would do because they didn't look white. They look like some mix. They look like yeah, they look mixed and something like that. But I'm like that's just disgusting. That's some, no, that's something some disgusting people would do. The thing that I didn't do. get as soon as he sat down and he heard the dog start barking, he's like, oh shit, dad's home. And you know, no, 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 no. That that was that was that was the, the sister. That was the sister. Okay, but still, she doesn't think her dad's gonna see this. Maybe sometimes that's the thing. Some people don't think that their parents have like you know YouTube or like you know wherever you share your videos on. But the thing is, once they see the video, you're fucked. Exactly. So I was you're, like, you the, and your brother the, the things you do for YouTube. A fucking hole. The things you do for YouTube, like with me, I vlog, I do reviews. Like soon there will be like a Shot Hunters review for the last season, and then then there will be like um a reaction to Be's, one of Beez's um videos and everything, yeah. and it'll be fun. Like yo, it'll be fun fun with my girls. No, but what's the funniest? And I'm thinking, okay, that's it. She pulled her, he pulled her in. And then he pulls her in and, and starts making out with her. But and then, says, 
I kissed my sister, not I make out with my fucking sister. But the thing, this is the thing. It was so funny. He's like, she's like, I think that's him. He gets up so fast. He, he gets up so fast. <laughs> no, I was dying. I was like, basically, yo. He basically ran. He was and like, then, fuck no. And then he came back. I'm like, no, that wasn't that. And then as they're making out, she, the girl said no. And then she then she went for, I'm like, oh, no. It's if, like, you, if, you no if you say no, just say, just pull yourself back. Just pull Why yourself back. Hey, Martin. Yet? Hey, Martin. Hey. Martin Luther King. Hey. Uh, better yet, hit the fucking dude. Exactly. And then, well, well, in mid makeout session, they were free, and his phone freaking rings. I'm like, uh, no, his fucking line. The universe is where this happened. Exactly. Nobody wanted it to happen. Like, not me. Like, why would you nobody. kiss your sister? That's just disgusting. If anyone watches that, movie, watches it, you have you have to freaking um. You have to not eat. You first. have to you have to blur out. You have to you have to go blind if you have to. like no disrespect, <laughs> disrespect for blind people. But What's like funny yo, is that you will never see I don't again. find it funny. Ha I find it like funny ridiculous. What if one of them had a freaking girlfriend or boyfriend? Exactly. There's no coming back from that shit. And then. Saying that she's a model and go follow her page. And then it's my, I don't want to know your ad no more. I don't want to know your ad. I don't want, I don't know, I don't want to know your IG. I don't want to know your Twitter. I don't want to know your Insta, I don't want to know your, your, your Snapchat. About I don't want to know because that was just less interesting. Like you, you said no like how much times? Three times I counted. Three times. You said no like three times. And but th- she and didn't then do anything like to push him off or. Exactly. Him. Like we're t- like I don't know about most girls, but me and you were taught self defense. If we mm-hmm. say no, it fucking means no. Exactly. We take her upper fist and we go boom in the nose. Mm-hmm. This was in high school, all the time growing up, and she doesn't look that much younger than us. Nah, and she's like, I'm a, she's the model, and then she's like, you know, you you at least owe me that. I don't owe you shit. You kind of agree to you it. You agree no to lie. the kiss. You agree to it. This is my two cents you agree- with this video. She agreed to the kiss. There's no like you owe me. You exactly. agreed to this. So you wanted to happen much as your brother didn't want it to happen. Just like I just got agree like she didn't have to, she didn't really agree because you know with me I'm very I sometimes I'm forceful but the thing is I to blackmail me, I her I blackmail her I blackmail her to, me, <laughs> I she, to me she can whip this camera out whatever just as long as I'm not on the toilet <laughs> TMI King. TMI TMI for my subscribers to be, man to be fair we were at the park one day with our friend Eric and we were sitting there and we hear her up up like above and we're like what the fuck is that <laughs> and we look and she's holding the camera exactly to us and me and Eric are just like this fucking bitch blogging yeah cause I was like I st- remember I started back in 2009 and so, what makes it worse is that we got up too fast I think Aaron almost fell with Eric uh, almost fell in and I almost did too trying yeah. to pull him back in that's true that is so and true like no bitch you're not leaving me alone with her but y'all can't handle me cause like yo I don't show my like my very outgoing side to y'all because like it takes a while to get used to the camera, especially with this girl too. It's my sister, you know. It's my sister. But like exactly so it takes like a while to get used to the camera and then like I'm usually like this, I'm very loud, I'm in during certain things, certain times and places and with people. Okay, let me so, say this. We're in high school. It's a freaking loud corridor. I'm walking it, all I hear is my freaking first name. High pitched. It's her from halfway down the hallway. And I'm just like, you know, you know, you know. Because I was on the phone. I was on the phone. And she's like, who the hell is that? And I'm like, that's my friend. You know her. And she's like, that's Savannah. I'm like, yes, why? She's like, I never knew that girl had that loud of a voice. I was an encore, aka you know. Okay, you know how you you're um, in your high school. They want to make they want to make things seem cool. So this is what happened. I was in choir in high school. Okay, I was. To... I think a soprano. I don't. I forgot which I, which part you I was. Were soprano. Okay, yeah. So, so I think I, I think it was soprano. And the point is, it is that we wanted more people to come. So they're asking us like, what um, name should we call ourselves? And then we we actually did a play on word for encore. So it's spelled E N C O R E, but we're doing on O N C O R E. So we're like encore to make it sound cool. If you want to do an encore, come to Mrs. You know Miss Phillips class. Da, da, da. It was so funny. Went. But the thing is, I backed out of a um. You want to know something? I was so scared because I had major stage fright, as you know, back when I started high school. Um, especially with um, Russell Peters oh, watching. You ran. I 
Oh. She was there. Mrs. Day, Phillips, I am so sorry that I lied to you, but I was so scared. I lied yesterday. I was sick and then my, my cat couldn't come to the graduation, but I was fucking scared. <laughs> I was scared. I was like, yo, I have a family emergency right now and um, I can't do it. But ever since, you know, um, what, what was it? Uh, open, open house? Uh, open house. house. So, I was in the open house and then Miss, Mr. Uh, Kistner, hey Mr. Kistner, um, asked me to like, you know, sing Who Said by Selena Gomez at the um, anti-bullying open house. This girl wanted to take me on stage with her. I was fucking... I, I you, were in, you were in my music class that year. I was in a dance... Okay. No, you this, weren't. No, you were in Lauder. Remember that freaking dance class that I took for one thing because I couldn't do gym class? Yeah. Because I had asthma and they're like, oh, I'll take you out of the gym. Okay. And they're like, okay, we have to dance. I literally had one of these girls digging into her, her freaking nails into my skin saying, talk to me. I'm trying not to freaking puke my dinner. <laughs> I really can't talk to you right now. And the worst thing is after that, I had someone come up to me. Mm -hmm. Were you wearing a bra? Ah. Those are jiggling around. <laughs> like, See, the big I breasts was, right I was wearing sports bras, but thank you. I have a big breast. I like them. Like, like, I'm sorry. Why are half the audience wear watching my boobs? You hold. <laughs> Why are half the audience watching my boobs? <laughs> it's like, it's a high school thing. Don't watch my boobs. <laughs> but it was funny. To me, it was so funny because, um, green grip. It was so funny because I lied and I was so scared in, you know, grade nine singing in, um, in grade 12. The grips are so good. I was singing in grade 12 graduation in grade nine. Possibly the grade ten, if I can remember properly. It was grade nine. It was grade but, twelve. But it was, it was. I was in grade ten or nine you, or ten. You were in nine. But no, everything in Canada has to be separate and locked in the safe. Yeah. Cause I got curious one day and searched it up. <laughs> Curiosity did kill the cat. The ID channels work properly for me. I know how to um. Um. In so many countries and so many places, there are so many different rules, and I feel bad for the people that. Like, I know you guys want a better life, but I feel kind of bad for you guys because you guys come here and people look at you sometimes like, oh, you're just here to do this or that. Me, it's just like, you were stripped of everything you knew. You just came here. You were stripped of everything you knew. When you come here, especially Kate, so first of all, we are Canadian. Well, as to you be know, fair, I was kind of. I, I was born in Toronto, so yeah, I'm Canadian. You were Toronto baby, so you're good. I'm a Brampton. Up, oh, God. Brampton. You just realized you're a Brampton child. Yes. <laughs> okay, there's nothing different between. Okay, the only disclaimer. The only difference. There's nothing different between Brampton, Mississauga, and Toronto. It's just that in Toronto, cities. it's different cities. But in Brampton, when like you're a long time ago, because she was born in 1986, I was born in 1985. There was not that many people in Brampton. Yeah. And it, was diverse, it was very diverse, too. It was very diverse. It's still diverse. But there was not that much people in Brampton. In it Mississauga, was. there was a little bit, so it was a medium. In Toronto, you're fucking jam-packed. Yo, Sky Rings fam. Yo, fam, listen up. All right? I call... No disrespect to my Toronto, my, my, my Toronto men. I love y'all. But don't be talking like the bootleg Jamaicans. If you are of a Caribbean background or... You have Caribbean friends, and you pick up on the on the speed, the language, and everything. Great for you. Don't be like nice, that fam. Don't be like. Okay, you know what? That hurt my that hurt my voice. That's that's how bad y'all <laughs> sound. Cause I hurt my voice, <clears throat> and I ain't getting sick. So the thing is, it's like, oh yeah, nice, that fam. Look at that man, them fam. Yo, you guys look. You guys sound like you have a nasal infection. No, a nasal don't. infection. No, like, like my friend Akeem is so funny. Like, you might see him here and there on my channel, but like, he is so funny. Like, we actually kind of mock in a funny way the Toronto men, but like, we're not, <laughs> we're not being mean about it. We're not being mean about it. <laughs> it's no, just, not at all. It's just funny to mock because it's like, I call them the boot like Jamaicans. Oh, true. <laughs> and it's like, sometimes, sometimes I meet them and they like, yo, that's Patwa. I'm like, wow. if you went to Jamaica, you're dead. Not dead, dead. Okay, but, but you're, like, you're, you know, you're just looked up funny. I'm just like, uh-huh. Okay. You're going to be looked up funny. I was like, okay, if you think that's Patwa, then okay. Like, 
I'm that I'm that nice bitch. Like I, but don't. But if you get on the wrong, my, my wrong side, you get on the wrong side, she'll kill you. Fuck with me. This girl, ask her. 2017. She'll kill you. 2017. She'll fucking kill. I don't want to go back. August. You know what? <laughs> I don't want to go back. <laughs> August to about September. Almost into the new year, fam. Almost into the new year. You see my eyes twitching now because I remember it. See, I was into the freaking new year. It was August 2017. <laughs> all the way. Okay. To February of 2018. Okay. So we had drama, all right? We had a. F- we will discuss it uh, in later videos. Maybe like later on when she still doesn't fucking twitch. <laughs> you see, I will always twitch because I have. I'm a Taurus. With, like I remember everything. Okay, so to the twitching dies down a minimum. Cause right now her fucking. <laughs> <laughs> so it's like it's like I don't want to know anything about it yet because I don't want to talk about yeah, it until that, I'm ready. That's so it's that. it's, it's, it's a, a topic. <laughs> yeah. So it's gonna be two years soon. Um. But, like, it's just funny, like, Akeem is from the island, it's from Jamaica, fam. He came here when he was young. First, he went to, he was living in America, all right? He knows New York, he knows Atlanta, like, I know Akeem. So, when he, when him and I linked up, when we met in grade six, and Sybil and I met in grade two, that's over a decade, I know Sybil. Sybil was a decade, like, Sybil was a Akeem freaking was like, OG. Maybe seven, eight years I've known him, so, like, yo... When when we link up, like when we linked up and we were talking about yo Jamaica and everything, and he told me this, so a funny story about Jamaica, I was dying because like yo I went to Jamaica and then about chicken and you know, his head got chopped off and then it was still running around. No, as long because it still yeah, functions. They, it no, was that, yeah, it was a that. chicken can function without his head for a couple minutes. Yeah, but it's it, kind it of was disgusting. Just, it was funny because I was like laughing because it's the way he it's the way he explained the story. It looks so funny. So like Akeem is a funny guy. That's what I gotta say. He's he's the realest guy. Um, aside from Ryan, I love you, Ryan. Um, yeah, he's the realest guy <laughs> in my life that will be like, yo, this is how it is. This is how it's gonna be. He doesn't this hold what- anything back. He's yeah. like a version of her. And a version she, of Sybil. She'll be kind of nice to you if she first meets you. Like, if you're like, oh, I can talk this language. And she'll be like, yeah, but maybe not try it out in public. <laughs> so if I, when, I, when I first meet somebody like the her... She's the quiet one. I'm the loud one, you know. As you can, I can see, you know. Apparently, I'm the quiet uh, one. But you gave me sugar, and that's a different story. Yeah, or ice cap. So I have to ban her from that anyway. Um, <laughs> so it was funny because it was like, uh, when I was like, yo, just because she was going through a rough time in her life, mm-hmm. and I was like, Jessica, you need someone, you know, that's a mixture of both Sybil and I together because we can't sugar sugar Sybil doesn't sugarcoat nothing on, with with un, with anybody neither do I so I just give you like like it is but you you need a male perspective so I'm like I kind of scared her I kind of scared her <laughs> she did she and really said, fucking did <laughs> I like, said fuck. <laughs> She looked at me, she's like, oh, it's a mixture of me and Sybil. I'm like, I'm fucking like, dead. I am I fucking, like, I am dead. No, so the funny thing is, I'm like, I want you to meet Akeem. I was so, I was so dead ass serious. <laughs> she, like, there is a I'll no like this, emotion like in her face. I'm like, I'm like <laughs> you the way you're laughing, you're laughing about I'm not laughing, you're the one who's laughing. <laughs> I'm just laughing at the backstory. I'm like, okay, I'm like, yeah, I want you to meet somebody. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that just drew my little face. She's like, I want you to meet somebody. And I'm like, okay. And she's like, but I don't want you to be scared because it's a mixture of me and Sybil. My I freaking like, <laughs> color trace. I was like, I don't want you to be scared. But he's a mixture of me and Sybil. And I was so straight face about it. I was like, I was so like. I killed the fucking. The when the face dropped, when the face dropped though, when the face dropped though, I was I was holding in laughter, I was holding it in because even though it's true, it's true. Don't get me wrong, it's true. But <laughs> her reaction it was so funny. She, I had to hold it in so so freaking long that when I went into the washroom, she heard me laughing. I was that's how long I was like I was actually okay, holding so it in. So we were at the mall, and she basically does this at the mall. And it's before I go to the Coles, which is a bookstore here. And chapters, yeah, well, yeah. chapters, yeah. And she tells me this, and then she's like, "I want you to meet somebody." I want you to meet somebody. I'm like, "Okay, why is she being so dead serious?" He's, He's making sure me, me and Sybil. Sybil. And I'm just like, all color drain from my face. I'm oh, just my. like, I'm fucking dead. The minute I saw her color drain, I was like, <laughs> "It's like I'm fucking dead. Like I am dead." 
I don't know how I ha I don't know how in the world I held in that laughter for. I don't so know long. how you made it to the bathroom. You could <laughs> barely walk. I was like. Okay, so she got up from the table. Like, okay, she's going to the washroom. I see her fucking move <laughs> to the left and then bolt it. I'm just like. <laughs> Um, what is, is going on? Jamaica. And uh, Sybil's right next to me. And she's like, Akeem is not that bad. I mean, for me, if you piss me off to the point where it's like... Okay, so with her, she's a verbal one, but when you piss her off too much, she will become violent. Yeah, so it's the thing. Talk about my character. Okay, that you was talk an about act. my family, which you didn't do, luckily, because you're alive still. Okay, no. Um, you when, talk about my, my, okay, my very so, close friends. I'm... I'm Full on messing you up. Okay, the thing is that I went through a rough time and I did call her character out, but I didn't call like anybody else out because I knew that that was crossing the line, mm -hmm. and I didn't want to cross and that I knew line. She lived. Because hell, I'm the same way. You call out my family, you call out my friends, you're dead. But the thing is that somebody got to me at some point when I was during my low. Yeah, so that'll be they a story caught, time. For they caught another, me off guard. I'm just saying they're caught for another video. Yeah, they caught me off guard. That's just what happens. Some mm. people get caught off guard. Some people are falling things. It'll probably be a story time for June because I got something for you and your ass. Anyway, anyway, when we're with people, like good vibes. I go off of vibes and energy, and you know, I went for me. Mouse TJLR, shout out to you. Um, when you did five sounds you're an impasse, I was like, oh shoot, I am an impasse. I'm not. And then, <laughs> the thing is, sometimes she would ask, this girl would ask me, how do you know how I'm feeling? I'm like... At that time, was the at the, at the, okay. At, at the time, I didn't know I was an empath, so, to be clarifying. At the time, when I was like, you know, it was like, near, you know, um, I think what scared me the most... 2016? I think what scared me, yeah, what scared me the most, we were in high school one day, and I was having the really as baddest day ever, and I'm just like, I don't want to talk to anybody, people leave me alone, I'll freaking fight you, but... Me, I'm just like gonna leave you the fuck alone and be like, bitch, don't come near me. And this girl, I'm in the library. This girl pops up out of freaking nowhere. And it's like, what's wrong? I'm like, where the fuck did you. What? You're supposed to be in class. Yeah, that was 2014. Yeah, you're supposed to be in class. She holds up a. Come on, share and subscribe. Wait, to my channel, you know. Check this girl out. I'll probably link her Instagram and description box below. And I'm probably gonna media. have her cut her out with things I said about equality, but probably not. She's probably not gonna do that. No. We're an equality, you know. So, we're an equal, um, you know, a world. Okay, no hate. So all love, all I positivity hope, on this channel. I really hope I don't look like a douchebag because I am not. She's very I sweet. Just feel like they should get more when they come here. She, she, what she talks help. is about like equality of jobs and equality of like you know um, schooling and not making it inaccessible, all that kind of stuff. So that's what she means by it. So if y'all make it, any other assumptions, you know, don't even try it because she's a sweet person. Half my friend. <laughs> um. So make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Make sure you <laughs> click. The description box. Look in look in the description box down below. Her IG will be on the description box. Follow her. I'll put her IG on the screen somewhere, you know. Um, make sure that you share with your friends. Share with your friends' friends. Share with your family. You gonna tell your mama share about this? Mama share is subscribe to you. I know, but you gonna tell her tell her friends? Yeah, she already told her friends. Oh, that's so sweet. Okay. You know how fast this girl goes to big on Euchre and tells everybody <laughs> that her fucking daughter has a channel? <laughs> yeah. I'm so happy. It's scary. Make sure you tell your friends, your friends' friends, you tell your coworkers, you tell people that you know about my channel, you know what I mean? I tell the people that I trust about your channel because I don't want people coming to your channel and be like... And subscribers, you know what I mean? Like, if you want reviews, make sure you comment below. If you want reactions, comment below. Story times, comment below. We have... We have a little bit of a lot. I have a lot of stories um, from Jamaica to, be to fair, here. We have a lot of stories in general because. If you want vlogs, if you love this, if you love my intro and outro, make sure you like this video on Instagram. And follow their social media. I'll link it in the description box below. Make sure you follow us. Make sure you show some love on our channel. Everything, her Instagram, my Instagram, Sybil and Sybil Savvy's Instagram, as well as our channel will be in the description box below. All social media channels are down below.